Men's Basketball Media Day was full of smiles and good spirits as the team prepares for their upcoming season. Jory Perry's caught up with head coach John Gross and guard Tracy Abrams about how they're putting aside injuries from last year to put up good results this year. There's no one that deserves uh, to have a healthy year more than him. You know, he's worked his butt off to get in the position that he's in right now from a physical standpoint, health standpoint. I just love his mindset right now. The, he's about the team, he's leading, he's vocal, he's accountable. Uh, the message he sends inside that locker room when I'm not around, I mean, it's, a, you know, it's great to have him in there. Tracy, no doubt you've come off of an injury, long-awaited return. How excited are you to get back out on the court? I'm definitely excited. I'm um, blessed to be out there again. Um, just taking it one day at a time right now and just keep trying to get better as building chem chemistry as a team. But I'm definitely excited. Coach Gross just talked about your leadership on the team. This is your sixth Illinois season. What's different about this group this year? Uh, I would say we're pretty humble. We're hungry right now. We are real chippy. We're just trying to keep it that way. Uh, we motivated every day. We know we got to get better every day, come in, put in the work. Absolutely, and you just finished up your first week of practice. What was the initial energy like around this team? It was really good. It was really good. Uh, we had a great four-day four cycle. We got we got a, got a lot of guys positive right now, uh, feeling good. So we're just trying to keep it that way. And Tracy, what is one thing that Illini fans may not know about you? Oh, man. I really like poetry, though. I don't know if people know, but I like poetry a lot. Wow, a chivalrous man here. Tracy, thank you so much, and best of luck this season. Thank you. Appreciate you. Mark your calendars for the first men's basketball exhibition game on Sunday, October 30th at the newly renovated State Farm Center.